Hello everyone, Jason with Innovations Technology Group here, and today we are going to do an unboxing of the Bauer Multipod 6-in-1 tripod and selfie stick. So this is uh this is what you get in the box. You can see some of that there. We're gonna unbox it here in just a second and set it all up. Uh, and we're gonna use the iPhone today to set that up. We're gonna make sure it works and uh, see how it holds up on this stand. So let's uh, go ahead and jump right into it, shall we? Okay, so we are going to go ahead and open this. We've just got places where we have some, some uh, things to cut open here. These seals. This is how you guys know this is the brand new stuff that I'm opening up here. And again, you kind of already saw what was inside. Uh, as you can see here, this is what we're going to get to. So. All right, now we got an empty box. Okay, so it looks like immediately we've got the actual uh, selfie stick itself. Um, charging uh, looks like uh, micro SD. I don't know if you guys can see that there. Micro SD port, USB A. Uh, looks like this is going to be what actually holds the phone. And looks like maybe something to hold the mounting bracket on. And this other piece right here. And then we've got some instructions here. And remove that. And then let's just kind of go through the instructions of what they've got here. So Bauer Multipod uh, tri six in one tripod selfie stick. Uh, it says this device can be used to take selfie style pictures with any smartphone or digital camera. In order to get the best results, please read this manual before using your device. You know, I know a lot of people don't read these manuals, but it is kind of funny how they always tell you in the manual to read the manual that you're reading. <laughs> so there is nothing on the back here, but and as you can see, it's just really this one page of instructions. And funny enough, uh, it does not appear to have any installation or, um, you know, how to put it together. <laughs> so, all right, it looks like this piece right here, all of this comes out, but it looks like this piece comes off. And this is supposedly the... You see it's got the button on it and that's going to be there for you to uh, when this is charged and there's the charging port right there on the bottom don't know if you guys can see that but um, if you're holding it out you got it on the thing you just hit the button and boom you've taken a picture and there's that little click hopefully you can hear that so looks like that goes on there and this piece, uh, let's tighten that up. Let's see. Oh, we'll probably twist this here at the bottom. Let's see. Ah, see. So maybe that's what this is for on the bottom. I guess if you want to put it onto another accessory or a tripod, you could do that there on the bottom simply screwing it in. So that's what that piece is for. So we can take this uh, and actually put it onto another tripod. So we'll just leave that on there for now. Uh, let's see. Okay. Oh, okay, look at there. Telescoping. So it's actually pretty long so that it can sit up, but how it does not sit right unless you put it up like that so uh, hmm. 
That'll be interesting. We'll figure that out in just a minute. So it looks like, aha, no, right here. So uh, we're gonna screw this back on. And this piece, you loosen right here, it can turn, and it allows the ball to move up to the top. And then we'll tighten that up. Now the ball barely moves. Now this piece barely moves. So we got in the position we want and from there, let's see. Okay, this is going to be the, uh, what they call an action camera mount. So we've got the selfie tripod here, which is what this is. This is your selfie tripod. Your action camera mount smartphone mount, uh, rechargeable shutter release, like I said earlier, and the charging cable. So looks like if we wanted to use it as a, a desktop tripod, it's actually uh, set up for that now. So that's what that is for. And then you can just simply set your camera on there or what have you. Uh, you can set any of that uh, on there. So if you just have a, a you know, just a, a camera like my Sony mm -hmm. A6000 mirrorless cam, uh, that would show up on there. Uh, if you wanted to use it as a phone holder, you could just simply... Uh, screw this. You've got two ways to do it. You got one here on the back and you've got this here on the top Which you can just simply screw in like this and just screws in and there you go Now you got your phone holder uh, this stretches And then you just set your phone in there um, If you wanted to use it um as a selfie stick, obviously you saw it earlier, it will telescope out. And then you can just simply uh, take this piece right here and loosen it a little bit. And then you can, let's see, let's loosen it a bit more. Then you can, you know, set it how you want to and then just tighten it up. And then it stays like that. So then you could actually hold it out and the phone would be you know, angled to you. And then you would use this piece, which you would simply snap on, uh, say right here, right? So that when you're holding the thing, you can also press the button while it's out. And that's essentially it. So you can, uh, you know, attach a smartphone mount to the action camera mount. Uh, and then of course you can, uh, you know, um, configure it in a multitude of, of actual ways that you want to set it up uh, using it again as a uh, you know for your camera like a, my mirrorless a6000 Sony your smartphone or, or use it as a uh, selfie stick and with it telescoping like that actually uh, you can really get some uh, distance there I mean this thing moves out pretty far I'm looking to see, oh, okay, height adjustable from 7 uh, inches to 36 inches. And there it shows that on there. So I don't know if you can see that or not, but from 7 inches to 36 inches, uh, the range on the auto shutter is going to be 10 meters, which is roughly 30 feet. It's Bluetooth. Uh, in fact, they say um, when you turn on the shutter remote, you could pair it to your smartphone. It'll show up as MO09. Uh, that's the instructions on the back. Uh, and then it should pair, and then you're ready to use it. So, okay. So, as you can see here, I've, I'm about to pair the clicking device 
to the iPhone. Now, right now, you can see all of the different, of course, headsets and stuff that I have on the phone. Uh, but you can see it's not paired yet. Uh, on the side, there is this switch on the side right here. I don't know if you can see that or not, but there's a switch there. I can simply switch that, push it down to, to switch it on. And as you can see, there it is right there, the M O. 09 Bluetooth, so I'll click on it. And there's a pairing request. We're gonna pair it. And there now it's it's paired with my phone. So that's how easy it is to pair the device with uh, an iPhone, or uh, I'm sure you could do the same thing with an Android device. Uh, and as you can see, I've actually got the phone in the stand right here. So uh, we're definitely going to be trying it out and uh, using it on uh, possibly future videos or uh, I'll have my um, A6000 Sony cam on it. And there you have it, folks. That is the Bauer 6-in-1 tripod selfie stick. Uh, glad you got to uh, get to the end of the video here. Uh, do me a favor, hit the like button down at the bottom. And if you haven't subscribed already, be sure to subscribe. I've got some other interesting things that I will be doing some unboxing videos on. Uh, today is Valentine's Day and my wife bought me the Galaxy Tab S6 Lite. So we're going to be doing an unboxing video on that. Uh, I know that's been out for a while, but we're going to unbox it. Check it out. Uh, this will be my first Android tablet since, wow since probably the Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.1, the very first tablet that Samsung came out with in the Android space, uh, probably a good 10 years ago. So uh, definitely uh, hit subscribe so you can see those videos. I've also got um, for my uh, Samsung Duo 2, I'm going to be adding the uh, slim pin cover to the phone and then of course attaching a slim pin to it checking out how it works uh, so again make sure you click subscribe even maybe click the notification button so that you're notified when i do these videos and as always i appreciate you watching to the end thank you again uh, i really do appreciate it so until next time we'll see you